Kyron Williams, rookie out of Notre Dame in the backfield. Stafford throws, passes caught by Van Jefferson. That run game going, and I love that he's committed to it. There's the eighth consecutive running play. It's Akers. John Madden would love this smash mouth football. And it reminds me of, frankly, what's going on. Stafford hands it off. It's Akers again. Ooh. Opportunity to be able to give back to the much less fortunate people. It's love it. Love it. Hometown Saints with a three point lead. Stafford handing it off. Akers gains a couple. And we had the opportunity to chat with another local pro for the Rams who trail by 10. Perkins hands it off. Here's Akers. And he's rolling out. From the 36-yard uh, line, it's Akers for a gain of two. Under three minutes remaining in the third quarter, the Saints have come out and scored touchdowns on both of their drives here in the third. Andy Dalton with three touchdown passes today. Plus territory. It's been all runs since he's been in the game. Six rushes, 41 yards. So it's not all is lost. Second and eight, and Akers runs right into the arms of Caden Ellis. There is a flag. Looks like a hold against the Rams. Yeah, Matt Skura is going to be working at that left guard as soon as Tano Passio gets in his area. Tano Passio is going to blow that whole play up. Skura actually smartly he goes and holds him so he doesn't get that opportunity. And Cam Akers see the frustration. It's a lot different when you had Stafford lighting it up. First and 10 from the Saints, 46, with the Rams trailing by 10. Here's Perkins. Ooh. And that's broken up. Gabe Nellis. Pass intended for Skoranek. Yep. What's going to happen, Perkins is a little late looking for Skoranek on this kind of rollout lineback. And then as he goes, Caden Ellis just makes a nice instinctual play. He almost gets the interception because Perkins is late on that. If you're going to go back to Skoranek on that play, you got to go a lot faster than that, or you're going to have to throw it down the field. It's good football, right? That's winning football. You're going to have a chance to win. You do those little things. Third down and 15. Pressure oh on Perkins. Sacked again. Caden Ellis. Passing you there as well. Back at the five-yard line. Yeah, and Caden Ellis did this last week against Pittsburgh as well. He goes up against Coleman Shelton. No chance. Going to rip right around him. I mean, that's like Aaron Donald. That's how quick he got right around him for the sack. Bryce Perkins had no chance on that play. Caden Ellis really starting to show why he should be a starter, right? Pete Warner's a really good player, but Caden Ellis has stepped up these last couple weeks. Two-minute warning. Players, prideful coaches, prideful organizations, they, they just weren't going to lay down today. It was, it was a good performance. Yeah, absolutely. Good football game. Really good. Bumping from the 40, Gilligan. Powell takes it at the 12. Well, he can go. Brandon Powell out across the 25. He told us how he was much more intentional, forceful about getting the communication right with the skilled players. And you can see it worked out today. Perkins brought down again. Kay Nellis was there. Carl Granderson. He's been sacked on the last three snaps. I tell you, it's going to be hard to get Kay Nellis out of this starting lineup. He is thriving as that fourth defensive tackle. We call this a 30 pack. Hey, real quick before the video finishes up, all the highlights are done. The only thing left for you guys to really see is the stats, but real quick. If you guys enjoy these videos, make sure you leave a like. Make sure you are subscribed. Only 60% of you who watch my videos are subscribed, so make sure you just check. 
and let me know what you guys want to see we can do more highlights you know from players we're limited to how many players we can do you know each week so do you guys want to see like carl granderson demario davis Taysom hill alvin Kamara? let me know in the comments what player highlights you want to see from sunday's game against the rams because not only is this my channel you know this is your channel i want to post stuff that you guys want to see i want to post stuff that you guys are going to watch stuff that you guys are going to enjoy because it's not my channel it's our channel my success is your su success because you guys are supporting me so i appreciate it i appreciate you guys you know all the support we're trying to hit 5k by the end of the year i appreciate everything you guys do just let me know what you guys want to see more highlights more pods tomorrow we're going to be having a film breakdown of the saints game i know a lot of you guys requested more of those so i'm going to post what you guys request so make sure you just let me know what you guys want to see more of what player highlights you want to see from the saints and rams game because like i already said but i'm gonna keep saying it i want to post stuff that you guys want to see i want to post stuff that you guys are going to watch because what's the point of posting content if the audience doesn't want to watch it so i appreciate it i appreciate your guys' support and make sure you guys stay tuned follow me on my instagram social medias and all that those are in the description make sure you hit the subscribe like come again what you guys want to see what player highlights what ideas what questions maybe i could answer in like a pod let me know and i'll see you guys for the next video